People in Apex are remembering two women shot and killed in their neighborhood two weeks ago. Police arrested another neighbor, Harry Hardman, for their murders. CBS 17's Galat Malaman is live in Apex where the town held a vigil tonight. Galat. The town's mayor says Nancy Taylor and Gabrielle Raymond will always be a part of the Apex community. Tonight's vigil was emotional as people remembered the lives of the two women. Their smiles missing from the town of Apex, a double murder taking away Nancy Taylor and Gabrielle Raymond from this community. We did not lose her. She was stolen from us. Monday night, more than 100 people came to town hall to honor their lives. Taylor and Raymond were shot and killed in their townhome community two weeks ago. It was a shock, a crime, a life cut short by an intentional act of unnecessary violence. The vigil wasn't just a way to remember them but support their families. People wrote messages to them in condolence books. These families now of Nancy and Gabrielle, they are a part of us and they will always be a part of us. Laura Frankie spoke on behalf of the Raymond family, remembering the 37-year-old for her infectious smile and selfless acts of kindness. It was clear that Gabrielle loved her life, loved her family, friends and work, loved to give to others, and in return was so very loved. Raymond and Taylor were good friends. Taylor's pastor shared a message from the family. She loved getting to know her neighbors and was always offering a lending hand when help was needed. And even the children in her neighborhood lovingly referred to her as grandma. Pastor Doug Stride says the 69-year-old moved to Apex three years ago to be closer to her grandsons, attending all their baseball games. She always wanted to be the grandmother who was there and present. He says the most important thing to Taylor besides her family was her faith. The community prayed together for the families. I pray for them to find their joy in the beautiful legacies left by Nancy and Gabrielle. Apex is continuing to honor the two women. The water tower is lit purple in their honor. Taylor's pastor tells me that their church will have a memorial for her in the coming weeks. Live in Apex, Gilat Malamid, CBS 17 News.